to the Aloe and Luna channel. On today's video, we're going to be unboxing Laura Wood Owls. This is one of the newest Laura series that have recently come out from Toy City and Laura Arts. There's been so many Laura series this year, it's hard to keep up, and I don't think I've seen a video yet of anyone unboxing this, so I'm pretty excited to check out this series. One thing you'll notice is all of these boxes are already open. I did go ahead and pick these up from Toy Donut, which is just a shop here in Canada where you can buy blind boxes that have already been opened and identified so you can guarantee what figure you're getting inside and for me as I always say on my channel, I have the worst luck with Laura's. I seem to never get the ones that I want. Even if I buy like most of the series, I just never do. I was debating picking up the whole series for this. It is a really cool series, especially if you're a fan of wood elves. I love anything that is elf and fairy theme. I'm a huge Lord of the Rings nerd. So for me, I've been in love with elves since I was a very little kid. So this would have been nice to get a full case, but full cases from Laura are so expensive. I was super lucky and didn't miss out on getting any of the ones that I really love. Let me know down in the comments which is your favorite from this series and which one you would pick up if you could. You can also let me know if you're really excited about the new Chinese monster themed one. That's the newest one and I really am debating getting a full case of that series to open up on the channel. And I'll show you right now what the secret edition looks like for this series since we can't see it on the side of the box. Alright, let's go ahead and open these up. I think I'm going to start off with this one and we will see who is inside. I don't know if these are still in the bag or already opened, but let's have a look. Okay, so this one is still in the bag. Let's open it up and see. Who did I get for my first Laura Wood Elf? One, two, three. Oh, we got the cute little fairy one. This one is so pretty. Oh, and I love the feel of this back wing detail. This rubbery material actually feels really matte and is slightly textured. It's pretty cool. So the first one we got is Spirit of Wonderland. What a cute name and I love this card. It looks like a postcard on the back. That's really cute as well as having the typical QR codes. I really love the colors for this one, but I think one of the neatest things is all the different textures. We have the metallic paint on the leg. The body is definitely a soft matte vinyl. We have this kind of rough textured clear on the back. And if you notice the two little baubles sticking out of the back, those are actually glow in the dark, which is super cool for Laura. I don't know if they've done glow in the dark before, but I'll include a picture of what this looks like if I can. And I love how the mushroom style hat says fairy on it. Really cute. The colors for this one are adorable. Oh, and I recently had someone ask me if Laura's can stand on their own. And no, most of the newer series have these slanted feet attached to the base. So you can't really stand them on their own, which is too bad. I think the wings and the glow in the dot bobbles on the back of the head and as well the mushroom hat are my favorite features for this figure. And I love anything pastel colored, so of course I loved this. So now that we've had a look at our first one, let's unbox our second one. I'm just unboxing these completely random. I don't know which figure is in which. And this is another one where we have the bag still sealed. And this one is really big. This one definitely has a big dress. So one, two, three. Oh, oh, this is the cute one that has the flower as the hat. I don't know. Every time I see a flower like this, I think it's a petunia. And it's also a little mushroom gatherer. This one is so cute. And this elf is called Herb Digger, which makes sense. It looks like the elf that's in charge of foraging through the forest. And this one is another one that is soft matte. I don't really remember Laura doing soft matte texture before, so this is really cool to see. I really like soft matte or soft touch vinyl. It's my favorite. And we also have some metallic paint on the clothing. And of course, we have the beautiful flower hat at the very top. And I do really love the mushroom in the hand and the little mushroom on the basket. I think it looks really cool. 
And you can see it says mushroom on the hat as well, which is interesting. This one also has super cute makeup. I do always love the makeup choices for Laura. I think the eyes and the face are really well done. Although I never know if Laura is supposed to be a clown because sometimes the makeup comes across very clown-ish. All right, let's go ahead and grab a third one and see who we have for this one. One, two, three. Oh, this is the super cute bluey purple one with the cute little rabbits. And we have Night Rabbit. I absolutely love rabbits, so I had to get this one, and the colors for this one are beautiful. I love the green, bluey, periwinkle ombre on the dress, and the dress is made up of a bunch of leaves, but I love how it's this metallic color. And the hat as well is very metallic and looks like a mushroom hat, but a psychedelic mushroom. And the bunnies are so cute. We have three bunnies in total, a beautiful gray bunny at the top, a white one, and this creamy one. I really love the dot makeup on this one as well. This one is really cool. I really love this series so far. This is such a fun Laura series. And we are halfway done the six that we have from this series. It's going so fast. Oh, and this one is open already. So let's pull it out. One, two, three. Oh, and this is the one on the front. And here is the card for Mysterious Dear Soul. When I went to buy these, this one actually sold out right away. And I was so sad because it was the one that I wanted the most. But I went back a few minutes later just to double check and it was back in stock. I was so excited and was so happy I could pick it up. I think it's definitely the best one in this series. I mean, it's the one on the cover. The one on the cover does tend to be special. And of course, I love flocked figures and this has a flocked deer on the front. I love deer antlers. I think it looks so cool in figures. And this one has like amazing colors. The colors are just so perfect. This was definitely my favorite of the series. All right, let's go ahead and unbox a another one. And this one feels pretty heavy. I'm curious which one is in here. Oh, and this one is another one that is sealed one two three oh this one is one of the really big ones this one is so cool in the clear vinyl and this one is called song of rain and dew what a perfect name and i love this one with clear vinyl we have the dew drop on the top of the head as well as a leaf hat and i love the white hair We've had quite a few in this series with white hair and just the beautiful water dress. The water dress looks so cute and flowing and it looks great in the clear vinyl. And I love the green eyes and makeup for this one as well. Oh, and of course this one has little flowers for the buns. How cute. And we only have one left. Oh, I think that's the one I already opened. This is the one that we have left. So let's go ahead and open the last one. One, two, three. And it's another mushroom one, but this is the pink mushroom one. This one is called Jungle Sweet Words. Maybe this one is supposed to be the poet or the bard of the elves. And I love the metallic pink on this one and the peachy colors as well as the gold. This one is just really beautiful and soft looking. And again, it looks like a big old mushroom on the hat. I had to get all the mushroom ones. I definitely think this is probably my least favorite out of the six I got, but I had to get it. I thought it looked really cool. So the shape of them is not super unique, but I still really like them. So here's a look at all of the Laura Wood Owls I got in today's video. I really hope you enjoyed seeing the six I loved most from this collection. I am still missing six of them, so let's have a look at a box. So I am missing three from this top row, which I didn't pick up. I'm not sure why I didn't pick up this one. It looks beautiful, and it's pastel purple and blue, which is definitely my color. And I do have the rest of this row. And for this row, I'm missing these two. These two are actually kind of my colors as well. You know what? I might do another order and get this one and this one. Or maybe this one. Maybe I should look at pictures and see what these ones look like. 
So yeah, maybe you'll see more of these. I still have one blind box that hasn't been opened before, so I don't know what's inside of that. Maybe we'll get lucky and get one of those. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you really liked this Laura Wood Elf series and let me know if you'd be interested in seeing the newest series because I am definitely thinking about unboxing it on the channel. And don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you on the next video. I hope you have a great night.